If you are a newcomer and you want to know how to promote your song, then stay tuned. What's up guys, my name is Molle and I'm a German rapper, singer, songwriter and rookie producer and today it's all about one question. How can I promote my song once it is released? So I'm going to share with you my personal experience regarding promoting yourself, um, social media marketing and playlist placements. So let's get to it. Bad news guys. There's almost no one sitting there and waiting for you to release a song. Good news, you can change that starting with your family and friends. Um, you simply need to ask them to help you promote your song. I know this can be tricky, but they can be like a dynamic multiplier. So when you ask them to help you, they should not only listen to your song, but also share it again with their friends. Um, and this also means it's not limited on the song itself, but also all relevant posts um, that needs to be shared, commented, liked, saved, the YouTube videos, but also the song itself that needs to be put in their own playlists um, and that needs some saves and likes on music uh, Apple Music or Spotify and so on and so forth. What you need for that is not only a nice request um, but also a nice appealing trailer that helps to share your song and this is also important if you don't have a YouTube video um, and also um, it helps if you have um, a song link. So this means it's a, it's a web page um, that lists all relevant streaming platforms with your song or a direct link um, to your song. And what's really important um, is that if you're an artist and you have a new song, let people know and don't be shy also um, to contact um, radio station or radio um, hosts, influencers and so on and so forth. However, I would say that you really need a stable product for that um, in order to make them listen to your music. But let people know that your song is out there. Having said so, the same holds for social media platforms like Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, etc. So what I do is when I release the new song, I let my followers know and text as many of them as possible with the message that is as personalized as possible. And yes, this is a lot of work, um, but it helps to build trust and also to have engagement. And really, to be honest, I don't want to be one of many with copy of paste messages, so I try to stick out. Um, also here, um, it's really helpful if you send um, a trailer um, and also a song link and ask them to help you promote the song if they like your song and of course if they do so um, be thankful and also um, repost um, what they have posted of course if they linked you and um, you've noticed that they have done so everything i said up till now were things you can do for free and only cost time However, of course, you can also spend money um, and if you have budget um, and if you want to have ads, I would really recommend um, to use Facebook Ad Manager. Of course, you can do the same on YouTube, um, but sticking to Facebook Ad Manager, um, it's just so much better than using the Instagram functions um, because with Facebook Ad Manager, you can also directly control your ads within Facebook and the way how to specify the audience you want to display your um, your ads to is just so much better. Of course, it's not really self-explaining, um, so you need to you need to know how to do it. But once you know, it really really pays off because you spend your money as efficient as possible. And if you don't know how to do it, if you don't have the time to do so, um, I would really recommend um, to get in contact with social media agencies because they can really help you um, to set the right um, ads for Facebook, Instagram, and so on and so forth. Um, also, having said so, um, I saw a lot of times that especially newcomers, they have trailers and they're like 10 seconds. And if it's for stories, I would say that's fine. But if you have 
like um, a, a feed post that you want to promote with ads, you need the the potential listener know what your song is about. So give them as much as possible to get them triggered to your song and let them make feel okay i want to listen to that song and most of the time that doesn't really happen if they only listen to like five or ten seconds um of the song and of course again also make sure that the trailer or the post that you want to promote with ads is as as appealing as nice as exciting as possible to get people hooked um, to the song and that they are excited um, to uh, listen to your song. Now let's talk about playlists because this is a really really interesting topic. Um, most newcomers they want to have a placement in the playlist and of course this is understandable because if it's a good playlist you will have a lot of streams, you will gain followers um, and that's of course a nice thing however um you will also receive some weird messages um from people offering you placements in playlists um of course if you pay should you do it well just let me say it like this you have to be really 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 careful because the majority of these playlists they are fake um they work with bots um, the number of followers is not real and so on and so forth um, also um, in general the things with playlists um, is that of course if it's a good playlist even if the followers are real um, the the streams of course will go up but once you drop out of the playlist your streams will go down again so if you're on a playlist it needs to be so good that also the number of followers of your followers are increasing so when you have your next release that you automatically have um have streams without being in a playlist um so really think about it if um if people offer you such things really check the playlist check also what artists are in the playlist because if it's only newcomers and it has like i don't know 150,000 followers it's a good sign <laughs> that the playlists are fake um also having said so don't underestimate pitching songs to spotify apple music and so on and so forth because of course you need to be very very patient with that and it you know it, not necessarily it will um, it will work every time but once you're in a playlist like that you will automatically gain followers you will gain streamings and the nice thing about it you don't have to pay for it um, and also if you have a good distribution platform um, they will help you to pitch your song to these um, to these um, streaming platforms um, and having said so just the last thing I really really want to say with all these things like promotion playlists growing your audience you need three things you need patience you need consistency and you need continuity and you have if you have that then i am sure um you will grow your audience but of course at the end of the day you need to have a great song well and that was it for today All right, you know how it works. If you like this video, um, leave a like button, leave a comment. Maybe you have some tips about promotion or playlists and so on and so forth. And of course, don't forget to subscribe and press that little bell. So see you next time. <laughs>